Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be taking you through my natural nail spa cafe. It's called the Chai Natural Nail Spa. Okay, today I think I'm going to have the signature foot spa and then my hands because they're chipping already. So I need gel and the shaman foot reflexology. So we have all types of teas here for it. All types of different people. So we have a cinnamon app. I'll have this one. That's my favorite. Decaf vanilla chai, acai berry, chai spice, of course. We actually have our own tea coming out soon and it's like our own blend of chai. So it's gonna be really delicious and it's gonna be available soon. So I founded the nail spa, I think seven years ago. Um, but back then it was just like a regular nail spa. It was actually a franchise of something else. And uh, we just had like your regular chemical based um, products, like this, the treatments, the masks, and even the oils were like synthetic, which I, I didn't really like. It took a few years of rebranding and recreating um, a nail spa that was more in tune uh, to what I really believed in. And so I partnered with my sister-in-law and we created the chai Every time her and I travel, we're obsessed with the drinks. We love cafes. Chai is one of our like staple sister-in-law drinks together every time we travel. So we really wanted to model the chai after a nice, sacred little space. It take, it'll transport you as if you're traveling. And I think it's really nice because we bring a kind of different feel for our clients who are looking for something different and especially something uh, more natural, more guilt-free, I guess. And so everything in here, all the herbs you see in the jars are all usable. Nothing here is really on display. Um, everything we pull off the shelves, we use them in our products. We hand make and we make in-house all of our massage oils and our cuticle oils and our cuticle removers actually just coconut oil and like a few other herbs. So it's all natural as much as possible but of course we have like a little bit of indulgence in here which is our gel polish and our uv light i'll be showing you how we protect your hands from the uv light using our chai lotion that has spf 50 so it's really really amazing so that's the spa and now it's the chai and we're super happy with how it's come to be Okay, so today I'm doing the signature chai uh, foot spa and manicure. We have cloves, cinnamon stick, and what else do we have in here? We have black tea. It smells like a chai tea, so it's really, really delicious. We have the same in the foot spa bowl. It actually helps to brighten the cuticles and the skin around the nails. It helps to soften it. There's a lot of antioxidants when you press herbs, especially with our black tea. So the antioxidants help to bring kind of like a new luster to your nails, strengthen your nails. So for our scrub, we're actually using a coffee scrub. It's made by hand and very gentle ingredients, uh, nothing toxic. We also have here a French clay mask. So usually we just use French clay with a little bit of water or coconut oil for your masks. And it helps to brighten up the feet and make them really smooth and soft. So at the Chai, we like to offer all of our clients and customers natural options. So even for our nail polish remover, we do have acetone, which is a stronger one for removing gel, but we do have a soy nail polish remover, which is also really great. For nail polish options, we have your usual gel nail polish, which uh, does have chemicals in it and does use a UV light. For OPI gel, it's actually five free, and that means just five, the five biggest chemicals that are in there, it's free of it. And uh, so it gives you a healthier option for your nails or a better option as a gel choice. Um, we do have natural nail polish choices, which I'll show you in a little bit. And those are vegan and soy nail polishes. We also have uh, nail polishes that are completely chemical free and those are good for children and even adults who really just don't want any chemicals around them or who are pregnant, all kinds of clients who are health conscious. 
So I'm going to be doing the gel polish because I need gel polish. I'm always working with my hands. And uh, my favorite color it currently is the Vampire My Buff, I think, by OPI. It's a really great nude and I'm going to put it on today. Okay, so I'm going to be taking you through some of our nail polish that we have here, which is regular nail polish. It's not gel. Uh, we have OPI, Ella and Mila nail polish, which is like this, these cute little colors that are really fun for kids. We have a brand called Kusho, which actually also has a gel counterpart. And here we have 1010, which is a really actually good quality nail polish and just some more Kusho. What's really great about these regular nail polishes is that they're all either five, seven, or 10 free of chemicals. So we always look at all the nail polish brands that we bring into the nail spa and make sure that, you know, the brands are trying to come forward a little bit and be a little bit more conscious about the ingredients that are inside their, their products. Um, nothing is like ever completely free or clean or, you know, completely toxic non-toxic, but um, we try our best, right? So here with gel, we need to kind of buff off the top with a rough nail file. Uh, my staff are really, really gentle because I have very brittle nails and that is a real cause for concern if you constantly are putting gel on your nails that your nail underneath will kind of just wither away. So my staff are really excellent at making sure that they only get the surface of the gel and not your actual nail. What we do afterwards is we will put acetone, a little, just a little bit of acetone on a small piece of cotton and wrap it in foil. We let it sit for about five minutes, the bare minimum. <laughs> and we'll take it off gently afterwards. Yeah, so this is the, the red French clay mask that we use. And it's just clay and water and I think some coconut oil. Dun dun dun! I would love to buy if I wasn't like held up. <laughs> Are they joking? You go outside real quick and ask them how much. For Dalandan and is that Kamote? Yeah, ask them. Sige, sige, ask. Sige, go at the job before they leave. Okay, do I know two kilos each? Oh my gosh, is that a lot? Two kilos each? It's so afford though. Thank you. How much? What What's the other guy selling, ba? Yung naka yellow. Okay, can you get get bananas also from him? So currently we're located in this really cute, quaint neighborhood uh, street in Mandaluyong. We're at P. Lopez Street. So clients can come in and have a home service. We only have four chairs, so it's very, very small. Usually if we have a client book, even if it's one or two people, we close down the spa just for them and we don't book other people with them considering the times, considering that we should be social distancing, although the chairs are placed at the right social distance space. Uh, we do, you know, we do want to take precautions. We do have sanitization and we do sanitize the entire spot after each and every client. Uh, but if a client does come in, even if it's one person, we kind of won't book anyone else w along with them in the house. We do offer something that is a little bit more convenient for our clients and that's home service. All of our wonderful staff are vaccinated and are, are sanitizing everything. And so if your condo or village allows it, we do come and we do home service for you. So that's also uh, something that our clients like to do currently considering the times. So we leave the mask on for about 30 minutes and now you can see it's really dry then we'll wash it off. And this helps to make your feet, the soles of your feet and skin really bright and exfoliated and detoxified. So it's, it feels really nice. Over here, we actually use, before we use our, our UV lamp, which is a real big concern for a lot of people and a lot of clients, we actually use our chai um, anti-aging and brightening hand cream. It contains all natural ingredients and it has SPF 50 in it. So she's gonna rub down my hands with this before we get into the lamp. This helps to protect our skin 
from the UV light, obviously, but it also helps to moisturize and to give some other benefits. It has really amazing ingredients. It has turmeric, it has argan oil, it has black tea, all the ingredients that are in a chai. So it has cloves, star anise, and it has ginger even in there. So there's a lot of anti-inflammatory properties in this lotion. So actually what she's putting on right now is just the primer. So it kind of just dries up the nail to make sure there's no excess oil on it. Uh, it, helps that, it helps so that the gel will kind of just like stick more to the nail. Yeah, so this is just primer. This is the base coat, so this is clear. So we put the hands in for 60 seconds each round. No more, no less. So definitely no more than that. We try to do the bare minimum here. <laughs> so she's going to be doing a shaman foot reflexology massage. And it's actually a technique, massage technique that is used to help bring balance back to the body through points, meridian points in the feet. So basically there are certain points in the feet that connect to different organs and other parts of the body. So as she's doing the massage, if a client feels a certain type of pain or discomfort in a specific point, our therapist will be able to let that client know which part of the body, according to tr traditional Chinese medicine, it is related to. So sometimes it's the head, the brain, the lungs, the heart, the stomach, and other parts of the body. So it's really an interesting massage and it also feels good. She does have a stick there that she'll be using to help manually like really get into those spots and points. That's for the brain. At the Chai, we try to be very unique. So some of our other massages that you could get, we call them spot massages. So we have a hand and ear reflexology, which helps kind of to release the tension in this area. So it helps to release tension up into the ears and it's really an interesting massage. We also have an Indian head massage and that releases tension in the scalp and in the head. And then we have one of our best sellers, which is our natural facelift massage. And it's just a really uplifting massage for your face. We use the Oh Holiday Signature Balancing Oil and we apply it with that and we do the massage with using the oil and it just has a glowing effect. It's kind of similar to a face gym, which is kind of trending right now in the US. So it's a really, really amazing massage. It's so relaxing. So this is our chai cuticle oil. This is made in house and it contains natural ingredients as well. It's infused with rose. It has lavender, coconut oil, and a lot of other ingredients that are really beneficial for your cuticles for hydration. And uh, this is actually for sale individually. Beautiful glass. Actually, we can refill these. And it says the chai. It's so cute. It's um, engraved into the bamboo. So here we have a big jar of our cuticle oil. It's made in house, as I explained earlier. We also have another jar that contains our in-house made massage oil, but it's getting kind of just fermented at the moment. And then we just have like jars of oil here. This is actually our French clay, but this is the yellow one. This is French clay in red. We have a turmeric here actually growing roots black Himalayan sea salt, which we use for a scrub. We have sugar, and then we have some other powders in the back. So all of this stuff we use in our ingredients. It helps to make the, the spa and the treatment so much more personal. And uh, you can actually come in here and choose which herbs you'd like to use. I'll show you over here. Here is our wall of herbs. So we have like rose hips, chamomile, we have rosemary, we have like a big jar of cardamom. It just like smells so lovely. I wish you guys could smell it. So we can use this in our services as a foot soak. You could come in here and add any kind of herb that you'd like to add. They all have their own benefits too. So we have mint, we have cinnamon sticks, black pepper, we have 
all of our nice wooden cups, hand-painted, locally made cups that my sister-in-law insists on having. And then we have all this like teas and coffees that you could order. So as I said, we're really big on tea and coffee, my sister-in-law and I. So we have like Java mocha. Like every time we travel, we pick up something for the nail cafe. And I think this was from Guam. And this was also from Guam. This is from the States. And then we have like a big thing here of ashwagandha powder which we can use in drinks. And then over here, so most of the stuff here is what we sell. Um, we have these like collaboration candles that we did with a local brand, uh, Sweet Sensations X Chai Nail Cafe. So these are all natural candles. They're made with soy wax and they all smell lovely. They have dried herbs in them as well, dried flowers. And then here we have these pumice stones. These are natural pumice stones that my sister-in-law sister and I picked up in Turkey. So we were on the coast of Turkey, right near Greece. And it, this fisherman was selling these pumice stones. So we brought a boatload of these pumice stones and we've been selling them to our clients. Here we have books that I've been keeping in the spa since the beginning of time. Books on Judaism, on Buddhism. We have Secrets of Longevity, books for women, just things that our clients like to read. And we have, oh, we have an evil eye here. This is also from Turkey. So it's facing the door. Bounce bounce that energy right back out. And then here we have organic turmeric and cinnamon powder, which we also just use in our products. We have these Thai massage herbal balls. So we steam these and we do a Thai massage. And it's not yet on the menu because we're still perfecting it, but it will be available soon. And then of course we have our O Holiday products here. So this is our hormone balancing oil, which is now known as our signature balancing oil. And we have our chai firming and toning massage oil. So we do sell our massage oil that we make here in house. Its base is apricot oil, which is really good for firming and toning the skin. So it helps with the elasticity of the skin. And that is like, like all the shells. <laughs>